Hello everyone, this is Fenris Lycon, here to continue our Surviving Mars game. We have the last war going on, and I've decided to place the Oval Dome in which we can do farming in. Uh, food is a problem with us, and I've also put a Van Sterling Generator. The plan here is this is within the de-dusting of the... our scrubber, so we can open it up and not pay maintenance, and it produces 80 power. For only, like, we produce all the resources now and we have plenty of them, so I, I think it's definitely worth it. Water is our problem. I have placed a few more, or what we had left, of our moisture vaporator. And we're going to upgrade them. That should be enough water to run this. The farms aren't going to... We're not going to have enough for the, the farms unless we put a, a water reclamation system down. And hopefully that will do it. Okay. Supply embargo is now in effect. We can no longer resupply from Earth. Okay. Can we, um... No, we don't have rockets. Um... I was wondering if we could actually get more colonists down. We have a food shortage. Yeah, yeah. We can, we're solving that problem. That is our current... ...task, I think, here. Yeah, we can take off one of the soybeans. Once these potatoes come in, uh, most exotics and metals, it was pure luck, um, we'll plan a visit here, and we're going to try it with one of our generators. That way we can send this rocket back and forth. We don't need this much fuel. Actually, maybe we do bring 30 fuel. No, it doesn't matter. I was thinking um, if we bring 30 fuel, we don't need to... Um, we could store the fuel there, but it doesn't really matter because we'll just load it on Earth. We don't need as much metals now. We really don't need that much polymers. Oh, uh, yeah, we do need it for the building. Because we aren't going to build solar panels, we're going to use the generator. Bring one more. And if there are anomalies, we'll come back and bring our explorer. Is this set as high priority? Good. Yeah, we need... We definitely need to, uh... Put, we have so many drones, we need to put a uh, recharge station. Let's actually do that. I think one right here should be fine. Tensions are rising at a rate faster than even the most pessimistic predictions. Things are out of control. Yeah, until we have that dome up, we're going to have problems. We need those potatoes. We need also our... We should have plenty of machine parts. Um, so I don't know why this is having trouble with the maintenance. In fact... Uh, they have it. The, the drone just, um... Oh, got orphaned. We'll pause it once this gets built. Alright, we have this to land too. We'll pause it. We don't really care about exotics, I guess. Um, we could do metals? I actually don't hate that. Is there any down here that we kind of want to grab? Yep, so we'll have to build a ramp too. And there's good polymers. So even just picking up... Uh, kind of want... Yep, yeah, put it in the middle. You will get a... Extractor down. Power cables, one, two, three, four, five, and this one actually, one, two, three, and it's fine there. We don't need solar, we can put the battery, actually, well, it doesn't really matter. We want to keep the battery out of the dust anyways. We can then put our storage down, put you over here. I might have to connect it, I don't think it connects automatically. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We don't see 
anomalies until we land. Interesting. So when we come back, we do want to bring our explorer and see if we can't do two, two trips at least. Connect. Go back. Resources are low. Alright, uh, this dome we now need to fill out, so let's connect it. This should provide the power and water we need. Now we need to actually put kind of basic surfaces. Grocer. Infirmary. Uh, Amphitheater would actually be pretty nice. As we're going to have a lot of in theory, we should have a lot of uh, botanists in here, and they do want luxury. We're going to want water reclamation. In fact, I might put that on the further one, just we'll cluster some farms around it there. One, two, three to start. Okay. We'll put some living complexes down. What else? We should put some farms, or not farms, some uh, gardens. I think just use a large one for now. Uh, yep, we'll leave it like this. We'll fill it out more as it gets populated. We do have plenty of like extra people everywhere. Sector scanned. Actually, the edge of this is a little bit out of range. It's interestingly, it looks like the dome counts as a single unit. So even if it's a uh, part of the dome's out of range, I didn't actually know this until I've seen it in this episode. I almost always try to put the whole dome in range of the uh, drones, but it looks like they still care for every all the buildings within the dome as long as the I'm assuming it's the middle tile. Do we get our potatoes in? Nope, that should help our problems a little bit. We have a little more water co uh, coming in. Let's open this. Okay, it is open for all shifts. We're going to... I think night too. We're going to put them on each shift just so it's easier to kind of uh, manage the service buildings. Also open up the night shifts. Oh, this, the amphitheater is actually quite nice. I forgot about it. Um, it doesn't take... Yeah, we can't interesting we can still bring prefabs oh we just can't bring supplies we can bring people uh we might we're just going to has died. yeah we're, we're we have our food now you guys can eat soy beans resources are low People should start making their way over to this dome. Let's actually check on... Whoops, not the underground. How is this? So now in theory, we can take off. And in fact, I kind of wish I brought more drones. Um, so they can start picking up these resources. Looks like that's what they're doing. So once we're closer, we'll go and bring basically all these metals and exotics and polymers that we've picked up. A colonist has died. Yeah, we're almost, almost have that solved. We'll wait until this one's full of rare metals. Uh, we might need another moxie though. Well, that's certainly doable. I think we put it here. Died. We almost have it solved. This actually looks like a pretty good spot. Let's get like an oxygen tank here and put another water tower in range of our warm ground. More research. We almost actually have the ability to build moisture favorators and so we should be pretty good. 
I did change up the research a little bit. I am getting the hospital and then the molehole. Even though we only we do have almost um half the research done on the molehole. Which is kind of nice. Alright, we sent you to Earth. I think we're just gonna send a blank rocket back. Alright, we've picked up all the metals on the surface, it looks like. I'm gonna turn the um automation off for at least that one. Great dust storm approaching. We can still get quite a bit with um with our drills just burning through these piles. Once we have a in fact has died. might just Research pick up everything. We'll be over here. Excellent. Alright, once we have the stone we should be pretty good. Although we're using a lot more water now, which is a little scary. Probably should have actually built multiple water towers. Um, to make it a little bit easier, I'm going to try to go for the deep water extractor. We have a nice deep well here. The problem is it's going to dust everything, but I think it's worth it if we can turn it on. A great dust storm is actually really, really scary with a new dome. Yeah, these aren't even full. Um... I'm gonna put this as high priority. I'm not 100% sure if it's just the uh... If this affects the farms or it just affects the uh, dome, Sector truth be told. Stand. It feels right to have it in a farming dome. kind of check right yeah no it is working as we can see so it's definitely worth it we're saving quite a lot of water we're on the dust storm we have to check our power in fact I'm gonna turn the fuel refineries off I should have actually potentially turned them off sooner because um we could have stored more water In fact, we might even close this pipe valve, just in case we get leaks down this way. Make use of it. With millions of refugees and governments reluctant to take in any at all, a humanitarian crisis of unprecedented scale has developed. We have a food shortage. We'll take in those refugees. We actually have a uh, plenty of room for them now. Some of them, in theory, should actually have specialization. Uh, this can damage your dome, but we'll just take the morale. Yeah, so it's a fracture, so it's only... Oh, it's a, three fractures. We have the polymers for it. Probably wasn't worth it, especially on this dome, where you don't have a lot of people. Uh, why are we... Yeah, there's something in the code that's, like, definitely single-threaded. That when it makes the check, and I'm, I'm, I'm assuming it's the, uh... The job and moving around resources are low that like whenever it gets to that point it like chunks out all right we're halfway through looks like they picked up everything so let's make a return we're not going to bring our vehicle back okay i can this is so, oh, i'm just yeah let's switch it to manual and then we can do it automated don't take the drones, leave them here. Request the exotics. Don't take the machine parts, we need that for... For our maintenance. Yeah, there's... We're going to actually probably make a few trips. As we need to... Uh, metals are just so heavy, it's going to take a while to actually move them back and forth. So let's request, and then it should take off. In fact, they couldn't even, uh, this is full of metals. If we put a deposit down, once it comes back, they can actually pick up more metals. And just the surface. I'm going to assign these ones over here. We and we might even pull a few more drones. 
Um, the refugees are actually going to kind of be needed. I hope they have food on with them. No, they're just passengers. Yeah, we'll have these until we have enough people working. The nice part is that it looks like the botanists are actually coming over. Funding received. In fact, we might want to train botanists specifically. Uh, we can't land this. I forgot about that. How long's the dust storm? Uh, only 24 hours. This one's a poor one to look at. Uh, we will hit problems with our water. I do want to get a rocket turned around. That's oxygen. Let's get this area scanned up. We can even bring our you over here. Yeah, we're going to have problems. Of course, it's like one thing we have. It's uh, dusted or broken. Should be in range. Oh, it's not. Oh, you can't find metals. A colonist has died. Uh, once we can land, it should be fine. I just need like a free drone. Dude, there's plenty of metals. Just pick one up. Repair. That's why we're having problems. I'm surprised they were able to build this passageway. Like, I don't know what's going on. Another leak. That one should be fixed. Okay, we need to land. As soon as possible. We'll get this turned around right away. We visit. So we're not, we're going to, I think more drones. We're not going to take any resources with us except for fuel. Um, I think control shift. Uh, there was a way to do this faster. Hold it, it works. Uh, we will take a vehicle with us. We'll take the explorer. We'll send the request. A colonist has died. We're gonna upgrade this Moxie. A colonist has died. I know, I know. Things are a little sketchy. We're actually... Could look at some of these planetaries. I think we actually don't have a commander. Resources is nice. Um... We'll have to unload it, but it'll be fine. We just got a little bit more food. All right, let's put the refugees. I want them to be in this rocket. More fuel. Okay, we need to land. And we'll see about have enough time. Um, I might just automate it. Yeah, we'll automate it. They'll take what they can. Oh, it's just complaining. I don't know. This is a little weird. It's fine though. Anomaly found. The rover manipulators held the silver white mineral. Oh, that's cool. Camera. Just Reduction in robotic tech. Be cool. It's interesting that they're not going for uh, the exotics over there. Maybe it's just because they're further away. It's just doing the closest ones. We have a food shortage. We have a food shortage. We can land you.
sector scanned. We may want another drone up, like over here. Put in the warm ground. It can hit. I mean, actually, if I move here a little closer, it can hit we have deposits over there. Yeah, this one, this looks pretty good. I think it's worth it. It should help with... Actually, we need storage for electronics again. Yeah, that, this... Whatever is happening now... Is... Like, whatever check really throws it off. We'll send you back to Earth. We have a rocket we can land. Meteor shower incoming. Sector scanned. Uh, whoops. Apparently I put it one too far away for power. Right there should be fine. We should be getting... Okay, we're at... Once these farms start coming in, we'll turn on the heaters. What's our time? I think we'll do like four more minutes and we'll kind of call it there. A blatant lie is gaining traction on Earth. Uh, we're going to submit to the instruction, uh, inspections. We might get some renegades for morale, but. We win the game by getting the war tension to zero, so it's probably worth it. And we can deal with renegades. Like, I'm used to having millions of renegades. Uh, we're just going to hold you here for now. Use you as a drone hub. Dude, I really like these Sterling Generators, the advanced ones, just for the power. Like, the heat ground's like, meh, truth be told. They do produce a lot of power. Sector scanned. It's nice that some of these Renegades were botanists. I really wish... I think if I'm... I might... I wish they were better about relocating and I think pro pro part of the problem is just not open housing for people to relocate to in fact we're actually really good on uh, employment browser comfort looking gambling gaming playing shopping so let's both of these places could actually use uh, I think I'm gonna put here I'm just gonna slow things down I'm gonna put nursery and a playground And maybe we put a um, a school spire here and connect these domes. We could also free a little space up. Well, we almost have this completely scanned. That's another milestone. Let's bring our scanner close as we can over here. Really, again. Um, no, we're trained for this. Like almost all of them have heaters. This is the only one. Oh gosh, I said that, and apparently that's not true on this one. Let's, we do need to bring, build a heater here. Man, these domes are really awkward to, uh, to heat. We'll have some overlap, but that's fine. I wish I actually paid the machine parts, but I think... We'll just cover it with uh, additional advanced drilling generators. We'll cheese it out this way. We do need polymers. Um, I think uh, we are not going to do it at night during this cold wave, but it's a possibility. How's this looking? You're all good and everything's ready. I brought extra fuel, which kind of stinks. Thought I moved it down to 15. It's just it's fuel though. We have a food shortage. I also ended up freezing my fuel refineries if I don't turn them on. I think I am. I don't particularly have a ton of fuel. 
We're just having a few deaths. In fact, deaths might increase war tension. We need to actually be really careful about that. We're gonna get our dome smashed in. Yeah, polymers are definitely a problem. We need to be very careful of that. Especially because these use a lot of polymer maintenance. We actually might want to... Uh, we don't have enough to bring some. A colonist has died. Get those built. We'll open these up. Power solved. A colonist this should died. maybe have a... Uh, yeah, we're almost done. We're almost, we're almost got it. We'll... A colonist has died. Water should be fine once we can upgrade these two. Okay, we are almost good there. A little, little, little bit on the edge. A colonist has died. Be it from the extra influx of colonists, Crud. shortage of help from Earth, or other reasons altogether, the number of recently perished colonists by unnatural causes is disturbing. Yeah, war tension has increased. A sad day for humanity. We are officially one minute to midnight. Whoops! How did? We get there um all these people dying so every time a person dies uh war tension goes up so there's a very very good chance just this uh food problem is firing into a well and water problem apparently into a end of the earth problem as Sector scanned. people on scanned. earth don't need to hear that uh died. of all the deaths going on Alright, do we almost have the technology for it? Oh, we do. Actually, we don't even need... We can just build these wherever. And we have the power, so I don't even have to care about if I hit the warm ground. We're very power... or water short. Colonist has died. Okay, people need to stop dying. We should be pretty good. I'm gonna prioritize the infirmary so people can actually heal up now that they should have all food and water and oxygen. Uh, we'll make sure we upgrade these. I need to build a power cable there, and I think we'll end it here. I think we've like recovered. Sector scanned. That's cool. It's kind of late for us. Um, but without further ado, this is Fremish Lycon. We have um, our little bit of uh, deaths are definitely causing problems on Earth, but I think we should stop that and we can start giving supplies. Except for polymers. Polymers will be our next problem we try and tackle. I'll see you guys next time.